This body cam footage shows Deputy Jesse Hernandez walking to his patrol car. An acorn is seen falling on the roof. That's when Hernandez fell and yelled. The sheriff says deputies were responding to a disturbance call in Fort Walton Beach last November. After a call from Marquise Jackson's girlfriend, she claimed Jackson refused to return her car and sent threatening text messages. The girlfriend told officers Jackson had weapons. Body cam video shows Jackson being searched, then detained. It goes on to show Hernandez heading to his car to search Jackson again. Oh, I'm hit. I'm hit. He was not hit. According to the internal investigation report, Hernandez says he thought gunshots came from inside his patrol car. The video shows Hernandez shooting at the back of his car. Sergeant Beth Roberts opened fire too. Sheriff Eric Aiden couldn't comment because of possible litigation. He did release a video statement saying the sheriff's office is working to prevent this from happening again. And we're actually going to use this particular case as training for the rest of our staff as a potential thing that we need to watch out for to make sure that we never put someone's life in jeopardy again. The investigation reports Jackson did not fire a weapon. It states the sound Hernandez heard was likely an acorn hitting the roof of his car.